So perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are indeed conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. We stand for the national anthem of France. Two high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Well, under normal circumstances, this is a massive matchup, and I'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away. In my experience, if the opposition go at it full tilt, then you have to reciprocate. We'd like to see excitement and be entertained, but if it does go down the serious route, there'll still be lots to enjoy. So it's away we go then. So Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, and Golo Kante. He is only one midfield. Real chance! Goal! That's the star dreams are made of, and that has to give them great confidence for what's to come. He was urged to shoot, and he duly delivered. I think the keeper has every reason to rip into that defence for allowing him to get into such a good position. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Dinha. Mbappe. Dinha. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. He's through. Can he change the shoot? And in it goes. And already they're looking to run away with it. A simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. <laughs> Things starting to look very comfortable. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Rafael Varane. Rabio. It's a good foot in there. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Mbappe. Shoots! Just one goal in it now. Game on. Oh, high quality goal. Lovely first touch. Sumptuous second. We have got ourselves a game here. Well, it was important they didn't get ahead of themselves and lose their discipline. He's gone for it. Good run. Lovely take, but that is where it stopped. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak.
Kimpembe plays it forward. Mbappe. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a... Well, that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. And it's Pogba. Now it's Benzema! <laughs> Mbappe just brushed off the ball there. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Bit of an appeal, but nothing doing. Brings it forward. Havar. Kimpembe. Digne. Conte. Rabio. Digne. Finds himself eased off the ball. Forward it goes. Pogba. And there's the end of the first half. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals, and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. Well, it remains very delicately poised, and based on the, the promise we've seen through the first 45 minutes, I wouldn't be surprised if this takes another twist or two. It certainly would be in keeping. Very little in it. Has a hit! A potential goal of the season contender, if only. Well, I just hope you won't let the failure to score affect him. With the ability he has, he can reproduce. Nina switches it towards the other side. Rafael Varane. And it's Griezmann. That's offside. Yes, it is. Benzema. It's a loose ball. Good determined running there, but one back by the defence. Well, he was thinking about headlines, I'm sure, but he ought to focus more on, on breaking lines. It's got through to him, Petty! Oh, he did the hard part right, but left the finish. He was so quick off the mark there, read the ball beautifully. If only he could have found a half-decent finish. Has gone out. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. Tolisso, Hernandez is charging up on the overlap. No, oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. Well, plenty of moving targets to pick out in the box. Obviously increases the chances of the ball being met like that by someone. France are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Mbappe. Gets it back. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue this situation. It needs to be... He's gone for it! Oh, he's 
managed to get it all wrong. Yeah, the ball in there was simply superb. He won't be too happy that it's gone to waste like that. We are into overtime. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. He's got away. And here's Benzema. Mbappe. So that's it. It is all over. Oh, whatever the shortcomings on either side, it was a great game to watch. Just one between them. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Yeah, they had a game plan which was about hammering away in central positions, and it paid off. For me, they were persistent and ruthless. And before we go, many thanks to Jim Beglin for his input, and from us both, good afternoon.